सॉल्व सेवन एक्स क्यूब माइनस टेन एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस थर्टी नाइन एक्स प्लस एटीन इक्वल टू जीरो हियर दे टोल्ड अस टू सॉल्व विच मीन्स वी शुड गेट द वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स फॉर दैट हियर वी हैव टू चेंज द एक्स टर्म वॉट आई मीन इज सी सेवन एक्स क्यूब माइनस टेन एक्स स्क्वायर In place of minus thirty nine x, now I write plus three x minus forty two x plus eighteen equal to zero. Did you understand? In place of minus thirty nine x, now I have written plus three x minus forty two x. That's it. Next. Now, what can be taken out common from these three terms is x. So here you get seven x square minus from this x out you get ten x plus from this x out you get three. In the same way, what can be taken out common from these two terms is minus six. So here you get seven x and here you get minus three equal to zero. now in this equation we have come across quadratic so i will factorize the quadratic here that is 7x square minus 10x plus 3 to factorize this we should split the middle term minus 10x So in place of minus ten x, now I write minus seven x minus three x plus three. I am not doing factorization steps. Directly I have split minus ten x to minus seven x minus three x. Okay, next. Now what can be taken out common from these two terms is seven x. So here you get x minus from this seven x out you get one. Now whatever you got here, here also you should get the same thing. From this x has gone inside, so outside you get minus three. Even if you multiply and check, still you get the same thing. Now take out x minus one common. So here you have seven x, and here minus three. Now In place of this quadratic, we should write this. I repeat. In place of this quadratic, now I will write this. So this equation will change to x times x minus one, seven x minus three. Over here, no change. Equal to zero. Now, from this equation, what can be taken out common is seven x minus three. So seven x minus three outside. Over here, we are left with these two. That is x times x minus one. And over here, we are left with minus six. Equal to zero. Now seven x minus three. Here you open up the brackets in this way. You get x square minus x minus six equal to zero. We got quadratic here. I will factorize the quadratic here. That is x square minus x minus six. To factorize this, we should split the middle term minus one x. So in place of minus one x, now I write minus three x plus two x minus six. I am not doing factorization steps. Directly I have split minus one x to minus three x plus two x. Okay, next. Now what can be taken out common from these two terms is x. So here you get x minus from this x out you get three. Now whatever you got here here also you should get the same thing.
from this x has gone inside so outside you get plus 2 even if you multiply and check still you get the same thing now take out x minus 3 common so here you have x and here plus 2 now in place of this quadratic we should write this i repeat in place of this quadratic now i will write this so this equation will change to 7x minus 3 x minus 3 x plus 2 equal to 0 more they told us to solve which means we should get the values of x and over here we got product of brackets equal to 0 so to get x values we should equate each bracket to 0 that is 7x minus 3 equal to 0 x minus 3 equal to 0 x plus 2 equal to 0 now to get x value from here I should remove minus 3 so you add 3 you get 7x equal to 3 now I should remove 7 so divide by 7 you get x equal to 3 by 7 now here I should remove minus 3 so you add 3 you get x equal to 3 now here I should remove plus 2 so you subtract 2 you get x equal to minus 2 so the x values that we got are 3 by 7 3 and minus 2 this is our answer am I clear